what's what's the feeling after that first one? Is it a sense of relief or is it just absolutely? You know, there's always going to be some relief with it. As much as we say, hey, you know, we're not worried about the past. It feels good to get number one. We can't get number two without number one, so we're really excited. It seemed like a like a sloppy first half, a lot of missed shots and layups and dunks. What, what did you guys do differently in the second half? I thought we moved the ball a little bit more. We made them reverse the ball in our offense, and then we got better looks because we moved the ball more. You know, like most kids this time of the year, they want to do it on the first touch. They think they can make plays, and so they got a little rushed in their offense. The second half, I thought we better did a better job moving the ball. And how about facing Temple? How do you go ahead and, and celebrate this, move on, prepare in just two days? Well, let the kids relax for a day and enjoy this one. And the coaches immediately will go back tonight and start breaking down tape and getting ready for the next one. No sleep. That's it. Just no start sleep. Start working right away. Well, at least we'll say no sleep. Whether we sleep or not, we're going to say we're not. So. Thanks, Coach. Congratulations. All right. Thanks, Marty. And, uh, it's just a great feeling uh, being able to be a part of this. And it's great to But uh, we're not done yet. Uh, we're taking it one step at a time. And, uh, trying to go for that second one, too. It looked like things weren't going very well. It looked like a lid on the basket for both teams. What was going on there? I think I think both teams came out a little nervous. Uh, I mean, it's such a big stage. Uh, it's a childhood dream to play in the NCAA tournament. But uh, the second half, I think, it settled down more. Yeah. And uh, that definitely helps us out making the more shots get something. Feel to get that first win, Brian. Oh, it feels good. You know, finally get that monkey off the back. San Diego State's been in the carry around for some years. Uh, you know, it, it's a stepping stone for us. You guys seem very grounded before the game and even grounded now, even after that first tournament win. What's been the approach from Coach Fisher? We don't, well, you know, oh, Coach no, Fisher's been no. telling us to play basketball, but we've been talking amongst ourselves and, uh, we don't want to make this the only win, so we don't want to make this like any different than any normal game. You know, once we get the championship, that's what we can celebrate. But um, we don't want to make this any different than the win. I mean, it's a special one. It is very special to us, but we got to stay grounded, stay level, and just stay focused. You know, despite despite the, eight, the deficit, the, eight, eight, the eighteen point point uh, win, it seems like you guys didn't, you guys didn't have a flow going in that first half. What changed in the second half for you? Uh, we just started knocking shots down. We got the shots we wanted early; they just wouldn't fall for us. But uh. Luckily for us, our defense was still there, um, and we were able to ride that wave until we were able to kick jumps on the offense. How much of Temple did you get to watch before your, before your game? Not a lot. I was more so uh, trying to get focused and to get myself in the zone. The win feels uh, great. Uh, you know, just to, it's another stepping stone for this program, um, and, and to keep adding on this historical season, uh, something special. But um, can't be satisfied. We got another big one on Saturday, and I have to get ready for that. No such thing as ugly win in a tournament like this when anything can happen. But how do you how do you describe the efforts in this game, especially in the first half? Um, we just had to stick with it. We knew they were a very good team and they are very scrappy, but uh, we felt if um, you know if we were able to take the game to to another level. Uh, with our energy, that uh, we would have a, a chance to pull away. Did it take longer than you guys thought to go ahead and get to that rhythm? It didn't seem like it happened until there was maybe five minutes left in, in the second half. Um, no, uh, we knew that they were a, a, a very good team. They were capable of, of hanging with us if, if we came out um, in, in not such a good way. Uh, but the second half was, was our better half, and uh, that's when we uh, pulled away. Yeah. I know you guys are always focused. You're always focused when, when you're out there playing. Did you notice the fans? Could you hear your, your student section making quite a bit of noise out there today? Uh, absolutely. Um, you know, when, when we're uh, on, the, uh, on the road, and uh, you know, to hear people cheering for us and, and, and yelling for us, uh, it feels good knowing that uh, we have a city that's behind us. And you have an early scouting report on Don Temple? Uh, no, nothing yet. I uh, just saw the game when he shot, but I'm sure we'll be watching a lot of film uh, today and tomorrow uh, to get ready for uh, Temple. And, and last thing, I know it's a big step, and you guys, I think you told us before, you know, it's about, it, you're not going to be satisfied with just one win, but how good does it feel to finally get the school's first win, especially your senior year? Uh, it feels good to, to be a, a part of history um, in, in a positive way. It's always something special. Um, but, uh, you know, I'm not trying to try to enjoy it that much uh, just yet. Because uh, we want to, we want to add on to it. Thank you very much, CJ. No